What's up, guys and gals? Anthony here with Special Analysis. Hope you're having a wonderful day. Let's talk about the S&P 500. Absolutely crushed it this morning. Fantastic setup. And I want to just kind of break it down with you guys the way I saw it, what transpired, how it all happened. So we got the morning started off a little choppy. We actually made a little push lower. And then we had that 815 ADP numbers report come out. So market takes a huge rip higher and then we consolidate, right? Draw this line right here. This is a line in the sand that we are not breaking. We're actually fighting the prior day's high uh, right in this level here, 42.15. So it is what it is. We were just waiting for a setup. So we knew we had a line in the sand to work with for one. And then we take this great correction through the 8.13 EMA. We push through the correction, close above, this line in the sand, guys, and that's it. Boom. Impulse, correction, opening bell hits, impulse, consolidation, target number one, in it to win it. Let me show you what that looks like. Boom. We buy it here, take profit. What do we do? We take about 50 ticks of profit, 52, 51, whatever it is right there, a profit, and then we move our stop. We were risking about two candles, about 16 ticks, we move our stop to break even, okay? Now we're not risking any more money. We just hang out. We're playing with house money. We've paid ourselves about 50 ticks here at $12.50 per tick per contract. And then we just sit tight, right? I mean, the trend's not broken. 21.13.8 EMA, all in sync. Price continues to respect the fast moving averages, respect the opening range. And what do we do? Well, we rally into a weekly pivot at 114 ticks, a daily pivot at 121, and a channel line at 125 ticks, three layers of resistance, a crap ton of liquidity right above at 4250. And guys, this is your chance here, 1500 plus dollars per contract to pay yourself a very, very handsome day's pay. Okay, that's it. It's that simple. All you got to do is be patient and wait for the setup. Check the boxes. For me, MACD, my, mod, my modified MACD, I should say, above the zero line, signal line, leading it. 21, 13, 8 EMA, all in sync, applying pressure to the upside. 15-minute bias, long, above both VWAPs and the VWAPs supporting the move. Guys, it, I give my traders my checklist. I give my traders my analysis. I give my traders... The interpretation what they do with it at the end of the day is up to them but guys if you want access to this information if you want me to go hey listen I, I think we got something going on here you, know, you may want to pay attention to i will do it for you like i do it for them so below this video there's a bunch of links click on them check out my site check out my service send me an email we'll talk about it first and then if you decide to move forward we'll get you set up uh, into a trading plan that fits your budget. And at the end of the day, guys, it really comes up to whether you're prepared to do something about it or not. It's amazing how many retail traders step away from the market when things start to pull back like they have recently, when a bear market, in my opinion, creates the biggest impulses to the downside and the biggest bear market upside corrections that you can take advantage of with a great amount of ease if you have the right data, the right analysis, and the right interpretation, which is what I'm here to provide for you. So again, next step is yours. Click those links below the video. Send me an email. Let's talk about it. If you want to get started, we'll get you up and running. God bless and have a wonderful day.